one of the things I love about living and working in Japan is that, well, out in the country here anyways, is that a lot of the customs and the old traditions still exist. And it's really kind of nice to be able to experience those, whereas the people in the big cities, they don't get to know that stuff anymore. As it's pretty much lost in the hustle bustle of what's actually going on. So, one of the things here is that we have chimes in my village that go off regular times during the day. And it's kind of nice. Maya doesn't like them at 6.30 or 7 in the morning. But it's okay. I like it. And I think they serve a purpose, traditionally anyways, to remind people when the times are. The chimes go at 7 a.m., 11.30 just before lunch, the noon bells at lunch, the 6 o'clock bells at dinner, and the 9 o'clock bells at night, which possibly signify having to go to bed. <clears throat> so let's spend a little bit of time around those times, oh. and uh, oh, let's just see what it's like, okay? And what they sound like. I love nature. And I love the countryside. So quiet. Peaceful. You can see the mountains in the distance. You can hear the rivers running by. You can also enjoy the 1130 chimes from the PA. And we're very close to them. So close, as a matter of fact, sometimes you can't even hear yourself talking on the telephone when they go off. But they're always there. And they're always comforting. It's nice to know there's a little bit of this old style left in this community. here when it's exactly 11.30. There's the buzz. I just thought I'd come out here and pull a few weeds, pick a few weeds for a few minutes. As the noon bells are about to begin. Any minute now. And we're always cleaning up here. I don't know why they're here. interesting things in this book. There's a section talking about practicing some meditation, being present, exercises in mindfulness. And one that I'm trying right now that I like, right around 6 o'clock when the 6 o'clock chimes are going to go off. Mindfulness while making tea. Prepare a pot of tea to serve a guest or to drink by yourself. Do each movement slowly in mindfulness. Do not let one detail of your movements go by without being mindful of it. Know that your hand lifts the pot by its handle. Everyone 
every night without fail. Listen for the buzz. And there it is. Know that you're pouring the fragrant warm tea into the cup. Follow each step in mindfulness. Breathe gently and more deeply than usual. Take hold of your breath if your mind strays. Here's an announcement. Listen to this. This is one of the kinds of things that show up on the PA. Tomorrow there's going to be the beginning of the uh, Kamishi uh, Elementary School Sports Festival. I don't normally sit out here in the evening with a big bowl of dinner, eating, listening to the rain. I'm out here so that we can listen to the 9 o'clock bell. And I'm moving back in. I wonder if the neighbors are going to complain that I'm too noisy sitting out here talking to you. You know, those neighbors. After you hear the bell, you'll realize why I laugh. Because there's no way the way there's no way that my and I sitting out here could be noisier than this nine o'clock bell. Time. I didn't have any 6.45 announcement this morning, but I set it up. Oh well, I was waiting for you, but didn't have anything this morning, so. I guess nothing special is going on in the village today. You guys have a great day, okay? We're up and at them. <laughs>